on an otherwise empty street. That's not just a Subaru coming into focus, but an attitude. Hi, cuties! Stuck at home <laughs> and owning it. Yeah! <laughs> Sigrid Dabblestein is among portrait photographers nationwide capturing families at safe distances Cute. on their front steps. Well, this is where we're all spending all of our time right now, just within the, the safety net of our house. Home has taken on new meaning as the world shelters in place. No longer just where we live, but where we work and learn. Weather the storm, and some days go stir crazy. It's good to try to bring some happiness and joy in, in the situation. Andy and Tara Peterson and their girls are among a couple hundred families Cute. who've reached out to Sigrid. Perfect. To have something that captures um, this time, just where we were and what we were doing. Something that tells future generations the story of this time. I love the bow tie, sweetheart. The time that we had to be six feet away from all your friends and the born is you have my life. Right. But, but being <laughs> together though too, right? Yeah. Cute. So for the Huffer family, some bad and lots of good. <laughs> Sigrid photographed her first hundred families for free. Now she's charging 50 bucks each to offset lost business, while also requesting donations to the South Washington County Schools Educational Foundation, for which she's raised more than $4,000. All right, look at each other. For the Hops family, <laughs> the most lasting memory of this time may not be separation. As many struggles as there have been, it's also brought us closer together, and you know, it's been, and there's some, been some positives that way. On days when it feels like we're in over our heads, it's good to be under one roof. Thanks, guys. Enjoy the rest of your night. Bye. Boy, do Care 11 News, Woodbury. I agree with both. Some bright spots, but it is like the bullingest year of our lives, <laughs> I think, even though it's only been three weeks.